Okay, we're here at 836 South Spalding Avenue here in Los Angeles. Now, we're here to check the main sewer line, and we obviously cannot check every pipe in the house. So you'll have your general inspector crawl underneath the house. He's physically going to look underneath at the plumbing underneath. We're here to check the main sewer line, and we're running our camera from a 4-inch roof vent. This way we can check as much of the main line underneath the house as possible all the way to the outside. This is pretty much the only place for us to gain access to the sewer line. And uh, to let you know that this inspection is based strictly on my opinion. So what we have here is we have our camera in the line. We're all the way out to the city connection in the street. So that's the city sewer right there. There's your connection to the city right there. As we come back in a six now now you see that little dislocation over there right at the end there in my opinion that's very normal it's not going to stop the water from flowing it's not causing anything to get caught on over there you're going to find this wherever you go pretty much with a clay pipe or cement joints they never really line up pretty much perfectly so in my opinion that all looks pretty good there's no major breaks or anything like that you got a little bit of roots over there coming through the joint over there Nothing that can't be easily cleaned out. Remember, this is a big six-inch clay pipe, so it's pretty much functioning very well. This all looks pretty good so far. Okay, so here it comes onto the property here. It's going to change to a four inch clay pipe which comes through the front yard. Now it looks like somebody made a little repair here with some PVC plastic. So this section of PVC it looks like it's in good condition. You can see they replaced the pipe over here and keeps coming back. This all looks good. And then it comes back to clay piping again which comes back a little bit of roots coming in through there a little bit of roots coming very minor little cracks now right over there go forward a little bit l something happening over here look stop there i don't know if that's a pipe that's been bored through the line or whether that's a um a root coming in over there but i've located that underneath the concrete just before it goes out into the grass area okay so coming back here clay pipes takes a little turn as it starts coming up the driveway over here if you're facing the house on the left hand side got a little bit of roots coming in here so we definitely want to recommend that that piece be fixed over there and we're definitely going to recommend a clean out be installed where the pipe exits the house because you definitely might need one one day in order to clean the roots out otherwise it's fair condition the clay pipe over here it's going to turn here and this is pretty much okay stop here i want to locate this pretty much where it comes out of the house so let me pause the recording okay so this is where the pipe exits the house it's going to change to cast iron pipe now we're looking at the inside of the cast iron pipe it actually doesn't look too bad it's obviously must be getting old but looking at the inside of the pipe it looks pretty round very minimal amount of rust build that doesn't look too bad at all now if of course the general inspector gets under the house and he finds everything leaking and stuff well then that's a different story because we're looking at the inside of the pipe we cannot see the outside this is the main line over here and now it's going to come up the roof vent Yeah, we, anything else, Al? Okay, so that's about all we can inspect. 
We'll go ahead and stop the recording over here.